All right, what's up, everybody? Got some stuff to do today. Good that I almost started on time. Almost, I'm getting better. Let's see here, Look there. So you can see that. There you go. Oh. All right, let's make sure I put this the right, I'm pretty sure I did, but yeah, all right, making sure. All right, so tonight's plan of action is I need to do some mastery rank hunting still in this game. Um, I think I'll be able to get everything done tonight that I wanted to do guide-wise. Railjack mission basics or I'm, I've renamed it to real Jack basics because I realized there's a lot to unpack with that so <laughs> that's essentially done I just I took a bunch of pictures I need to stick them in and then post it that'll be done for tomorrow as is for sure um, as for the video guide it is for Drizzlewood Coast and that I'm still debating if I want to do that in two chunks or not because when the content released for the that map it was in two parts so I'm thinking I'm going to do it all in one shot because it's pretty much is the same mechanics this it's a giant is it bigger it's a huge map I actually made some decent coffee <clears throat> So yeah, um, I, mean, I still need to go work on these things. I have a crap ton to spend in there too, but I need, I need, I need these points. So we are going to do some Secrets of the Obscure because that's another one that I wanted to work on. Actually, we might end up going a little bit into dragons who just to level up. I don't know. There's so much to do in this game, just like the other one. Casey Nuna, hey, how's it going? Mm hmm. I saw that. I, at first, I was like, who is it? Because I, I get the notifications. I'm like, who is this? Because I don't remember the name. And then I went and I clicked on it. I'm like, oh, it's Riri. How's it going? Yeah, no, like legit. Um, since I have the I have a touch portal on the on the tablet over here and every single time I turn it on and then it says like these notifications, I'm like, what the hell is that? So no, but hey <laughs> You're tormenting yourself, uh oh, what are you doing? <clears throat> Cause I know I'm tormenting myself, but that's probably a different way. <laughs> oh no. If it makes you feel any better, I went to the store and I got some gummies. <laughs> Not exactly super sour, but really wanted some gummies to just like grind my teeth into. Oh, that's that sounds bad. That sounds like maybe mistakes have been made. I'm hoping to God it's not bad. I have a shark. <laughs> Are they good? I mean, when you say super sour candies. Like, on a scale of one to, like, ungodly sour. I'm guessing that they're super sour then. Dude, I remember Warheads. Do you remember what did do do they even make Warheads anymore? You made faces. Oh man. Right, two more gummies and that's it. Your jaws hurt? Oh man. Are they hard or are they squishy like gummies? Oh, 
powder. They're gushers. Oh, those are, that sounds really good. Isn't it like what the Warheads used to be? I remember like a long, long time ago that there used to be something called Warheads and they were supposed to be sour. And honestly, you just, I still had to dress the shit out of that. Like I ended up putting some like lime juice or maybe it's lemon. I think it was like the lime juice on top of the Warheads just to make them even more sour. It sounds legit. Sour gushers covered in sour. Excuse me. Extra sour dust. That sounds like it's probably like citric acid. Citric acid is especially sour. Um, here in Mexico, um, talking about gummies and sour stuff. So, I don't know if you're familiar with um, like the Coca Cola gummies. It's supposed to they taste like Coca Cola. Well, they have them here, but they have like these little like sprinkled things on top. And I'm just like, what the shit is this? And then you go and you eat it and it's like, there's, there's a bite to it. Right. And that's pretty much like all of the gummies here that you get like this alongside the road. That sounds really weird saying that out loud. But when you live in Mexico, or if you at least visit Mexico or maybe some other country that's got stuff like that, it doesn't sound that weird. <laughs> but... I'm trying to not sound like I just buy stuff from random, I mean, you kind of do buy stuff from random strangers on the road, but <laughs> that doesn't make it sound any better. But no, citric acid's really sour in some, some places. Mmm. Chamoy is amazing. Oh, okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Hold up, hold up. Since we're going to go on this conversation, hold on. Let me find... I don't know what they're called. Um, Alright. Here in Mexico, we have something that's called Miguelito, Miguelito Chamoy. It's like... it's a, I, I don't even know how to explain this flavor or what this what this tastes like it's it's sour but it's not exactly sour it's like salty sour uh oh hold on hold on ah stream elements why did you do that because you posted a link hold on hey Vic I need you to get on a on as a mod. Whoa, 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 you got stuff. Stream elements time someone up. I need you to do I don't know how to do it through OBS. It gets stupid. Hold on. Hold on. Bear with me. Last time I went looking for how to do stuff through mod stuff on OBS, it gave me issues. Like I completely ruined everything my layout so hold on we're getting a mod on that hold on hold on don't you just open the website and you see it but okay next time you need something but i can do that I... where do i go for that then i don't know just don't go know. to the fucking chat okay yes. okay we're going hold on we're learning this to your chat thingy stream this is the chat it? thingy right here Who's in chat? Oh my god, this is gonna... These are not the mod tools I know. Yeah, that's why I'm like, I don't even... Mm. No, no. It says, I mean, I can see the mod actions. I don't know how to... Like, right click does nothing. It can translate to English. I don't know. Okay, we're, we're not paying him this weekend. <laughs> I was not getting paid. Oh no, it's... You can see mod comments, mod action, message, that's, 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 that's all I got. You rested for the biscuit. <laughs> I am so sorry. Oh, hey, on timeout. Hey, I found it. I think, I don't know, I think, no. I think I fixed it. I can do that, yes. Okay, so it's slash untimeout. Anyway, 
going back to this. So, <laughs> I am so sorry. That was embarrassing. I don't really do much of it, that, but anyway. Slash untimeout. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, my, my stream elements gets a little creepy sometimes. <laughs> Seriously, last time I tried to do that through OBS, it threw a fit and then I, I killed OBS. I couldn't get things to come back up. Nice. So these things, right? So you get this. It's usually like you get the Miguelito and then you can get the Chamoya over here. And then you get carrot, shred the carrot, and you just sprinkle the shit out of the, the Miguelito. You slap some Chamoya on there. You get a lime or two. You squeeze the juice on that. Oh my God. I don't know what that is called here in Mexico, but it is amazingly delicious. It's like you're eating healthy, but also you're putting junk food on it because... It's like a, what we call Dori Locos. Yes, you can also make holes in your stomach. Yep. Dori Locos. I don't want you to find my ass. Are you kidding me? This? It looks disgusting, right? It's not disgusting. It looks disgusting. But it's really good. Get a Dorito bag, slice it open, you put a bunch of stuff in it, especially just, you can even go basic. You don't even need the peanuts. You, you can just get a, the Doritos. You used to do that. <laughs> you get the Doritos, you get the like shredded jicama, shredded carrots, the chamoy, the miguelito. Cucumber. 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 Yeah, cucumber. Lime. Okay, you know what's up then. Yeah, no, just, oh God. And then here's the kicker, right? Three houses that way is the street. And the guy that lives there actually leases out some of his um, area so that people can like do some vending there. One of them makes the stuff and it's not that expensive. And I'm like, oh, you play a dangerous game with me. <laughs> Ah, yes, the Umbrella Lady. Yep, Umbrella Ladies are awesome. People are going to be like, what the hell are they talking about? No, man, um, Umbrella Ladies? There's, the, there's that one. Um, I know that we have, I called her the Orange Juice Lady. She squishes fresh oranges every morning outside the church. It's nearby. Mmm, so good. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's a new one though, the Dori Esquites. I still need to try that one. Doritos with Esquites. <clears throat> yeah, no, it's good. It's good. It's good. I like a lot of weird things I have discovered here. Mm. So, so good. I also found out that we are out of chamoy slash Miguelito because we had some leftover carrot shredded from my salad earlier today. <laughs> oh, God, but... Mm. And then, okay, so there's, there's different types of Cheetos, right? There's, like, your basic Cheetos, like the name brand Cheetos, and then they've got, like, these big puffy Cheetos, and then there's two different types of those that I have discovered. There's the ones that look... <laughs> That I knew. That one I knew. <laughs> I remember that. But yeah, there's like the radioactive orange Cheetos, and then there's like your basic orangey yellow Cheetos. The radioactive ones taste better, in my opinion. Yeah. I remember the I remember the Korean Mexican conversation because um, I was. Oh, what was that? It was a, it was a coffee. It was coffee from Korea that my sister had sent. It was a, not milk tea. That's, my brain is having a problem right now. It 
It was like the milk coffee in a packet, and then you stick it in the water, and we found out that was kind of weak. We had to, like, put two of them in... Oh. I can't remember the name of it. It's been years. Maxim. Yeah, that. That's the conversation I remember. Also, yeah, the chips are better here. Dude, they got chip vendors. They have, they have chip vendors, and you can get you can get Valentina and lime squished on top of it, and just walk around. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, why are they burning hot Cheetos in California? Are they too hot? That sounds like some bullshit. That sounds sus. This is why you can have nice things, I guess. Coffee is done. Let's go. We vibrate an entire night. Where did I leave myself? I have no recollection of this. This, the mango is a fruit. Oh, fruit cups. Yeah, they got fruit cups too. They got fruit cups and street vendors, and sometimes you can see them pushing carts. I found out that I'm actually allergic to the skin on mangoes. Sad day on that part. I am really allergic to poison ivy, and then when Vic was working, this is like years ago, and we bought mangoes because they were pretty cheap. And then I go and I start peeling them, you know, and doing everything. And I was doing this for like maybe a couple of days straight. And then I started breaking out in the face and I, and on my hands. And I was just like, oh my God, it has been like 20 years since I have had a poison ivy breakout. Turns out if you are allergic to poison ivy or poison sumac or anything that is related to that, you're probably going to be allergic to the skins of mangoes. Hard truth on that. I was getting worried because the last time that I had a nasty poison ivy breakout, I had to go to the hospital to get an injection because it was bad. Woo. But yeah, that is, mm. Why are they banning hot Cheetos though? Like, that makes no sense. Oh, coffee burps. Mm. Drizzlewood is bigger than Lornar's past. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. I felt like it was. And I despise Lornar's past. Alright, well, we're gonna go do Secrets of the Obscure stuff for a little bit. Palette cleanser. Let's go find some things here. Oh, we got cat food, so the cat can stop bitching at us. Is this from Huera? Coco? Did she tell her that the cat's on strike? What did she say? No, she gave it that because Coco didn't like that one. He, he, he what got, is this one? Is this the... Sick. I don't know. Huh. Let's see. Pita. The dog eats anything. Hold on, I'm gonna see. <laughs> so we bought cat food for our indoor outdoor cat. The one that the street cat that adopted us. And uh, we usually get her cat chow. Well, they were out of cat chow. And I remember last time that I had to buy something that wasn't cat chow because they were out of cat chow. I bought this other one, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure she liked that one. So we bought it, and she has turned her nose up at that, and she's like, I don't want to deal with that food. That food is gross. That food is icky. And then she even invited her friend. So now we named that one Sir Chubbs. He doesn't even like that food. I'm just like, what finicky pieces of street cats these guys are. 
She used to eat somewhere else. Food that she didn't like. Mm -hmm. But she used to come here to puke. Like, here, look what I'm eating because you're not feeding me, fucker. Yeah, and then that, oh my god. And then, and then when we couldn't get cat chow because we didn't have any extra cash to get it. Because I'm going to be honest, she's an indoor outdoor cat. She's got like four other houses that she gets food from, so... But she would go to somebody else's place and she would intentionally eat the cat food there. It was not the one that she liked. And she would come to our doorstep and she would throw it up. People who say that cats don't hold grudges or they can't be petty clearly have never had to deal with one of those. <laughs> because, dear God. Oh, did I miss it? I missed it. Oh, darn. Yeah, no worries. Oh, I turned it off. Yeah. Oh, I forgot today's Friday. Go do some more first world. I don't even know who the hell we're with because I've been working on other stuff. We are with eBay again. Hey. It's been a while. Sanctum of Raw and Kinding. Erdon Terrace with JQ. Holy crap. Oh, wooga wooga dive dive dying woo. Those things. Oh, that reminds me. So if you are new to this zone still, or if you're looking for an easy mastery rank points, or Secrets of the Obscure, was it like two weeks ago? I made a guide for one uh, Guardian Shrine Spirits. Basically, you find a bunch of rocks, you find a bunch of sticks, and you play hide and seek with something. It takes you like 30 minutes to get it. In my case, it was more like an hour because I had to make sure I was getting the nice, good picture for it and then typing up stuff, so. <clears throat> Ooh, strawberries. You got it, Bone Fiend. You got this. You can do it. I believe in you. Look at that. Oh, shit! Champion's coming to get me. That's the weirdest looking prairie dog I have ever seen in my life. You know, I'm, I'm starting to think that since we don't actually have horses in this game, that maybe we actually do have horses and they're just called something else because... What kind of prairie dog is that? That is clearly not a prairie dog. I don't, like, I don't even know, man. I don't know. Closest thing I've seen to a horse in this game was, was a Kirin. I mean... And that's kind of stretching it. Let's go to Amnitas, see what's going on over there. I have to go into the fridge and crack, crack a nice cold one. 
But it's going to be a long night. I could probably just bring up the event timer and see what's going on. Instead of doing this. I was kind of hoping that there'd be some like random rifts that I would come across, but that might be something that people aren't doing anymore. I don't know. <clears throat> Screw it. I'm going to go get it. Hold on. It's creamy, it's smooth. Hmm. Oh, one. The moment you realize that you push the wrong button because your fingers are not centered where they're supposed to be. South. Man, now I'm actually just thinking, mm, World vs. World sounds nice. Screw it, let's go. If I park myself here, will I be safe? Probably not. Everything in this game tries to kill you whenever you log in. Can actually land. Okay, Let's take it. Um, right, let's go through this stuff. Then we can switch over. Yeah, no, World vs. World sounds good. Or because the more I'm thinking about it, the more I'm just like, I have to do that thing for Joseph Wood tomorrow, which is actually going to be tonight because we've got plans tomorrow. This massacre. Now we got Dorito goats of happiness. As you say, the, the longhorn sheep next to me makes a sound. You know what? I'll go with it. I'll go with it. Makes no goddamn sense, but you know what? I'll go with it. <laughs>
Kitty, what are you doing tonight? Swear to God, if you tell me house hunting, I'm going to be like, you are never going to end your hunts for housing. Okay, that's different. <laughs> I don't have to do that anymore. You just uh, unequip, unequip, unequip. Why are these things? I give up trying to make sure that things have things on here. I just, I can't be able to. Umber is alive. Jesus. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Switching characters. Alright, Umber, let's find you in the box. And you. Umber is still alive. Umber is surviving school. Oh, that reminds me, I'm pretty sure everybody at this point in time that this actually matters to for the Vampire Masquerade. You guys have pretty much all checked in with Hellraiser. He's going to be taking over. The um, Vampire game. So. Play nice. <laughs> nah, you guys will be fine. You guys know him. Um, as I understand it, you guys actually will not be needing the foundry for it anymore. I think you will be dealing with it purely inside Discord. Um, I don't know yet, Umber. I'm gonna be honest. How many was that? 19? Hold on. 1, 2, 3. I honestly don't know. Um, I know that tomorrow, Vic and I, we are actually going to have a date day. That sounds scary, I know. But we haven't been on a date on a Saturday for over a year. So, of our choosing. So, taking, taking this time to do it. All right, Umber, there you go. Yeah. Um. It's bonkers. Not really. Especially when you get consider our day starts at like one or two o'clock in the afternoon. So. Nah. No, no, we're actually going to go out because what you just described, Kitty, is pretty much what we do every day, so. <laughs> We're actually going to, I, I still don't even know where we're going to go, but we're going to go some place, some places. Might go to the, um, a plaza that's not across the street. I 
I'm thinking Galerias. We have a couple of cool places to visit in there, go wandering around. Suksasuki is no longer there because they had some really good food. <clears throat> I mean, they do have a Burger King, they also have a McDonald's. Surprisingly, the only time I actually got food poisoning here is two different times. One of them was getting gorgonzola cheese at Italiani's, which is a sit-down restaurant. That cheese made me so ill. And then the other one was... <sighs> Meats from a meat shop, not the one that we have here. Like this one, we actually have to walk to. Something wasn't right about that one. I mean, even Vic got sick with that one. That's the only time I've actually had food poisoning here from somewhere that we ate out or got food from. You actually don't get, it's super rare, I think, to get food poisoning from food stands. By the way, if you ever visit Mexico, or Mexico City to be specific, do not go to Italiani's. Save yourself the headache and the trouble. Food's not that good. They might try to make you think it's good. You might get that idea that it might be like an olive garden. No. No. It's not that good. Diddy, you are always playing in the kitchen. I would do air quotes by moving my character. Playing in the kitchen. <clears throat> Alright, start the timer now. It says 7.44 on my watch. We're not going to see her for like three hours. Wait, 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 wait. All right, seven forty five. I wrote it down. If we see her when she says whatever time, this yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. You're being timed, Kitty. Of course, homemade is better for you, but when that's all you have is homemade, 
It's nice to go out and get something, you know? Like once a week, once a week go out. Just for your mental insanity check, you know? Like. By the way, going back to Umber's question, I may or may not be over around tomorrow. I don't know. This is how see how the day goes. If anything, I might come in towards the end of it. I don't think I'll be there at the beginning. Yeah, we were green, we were mid, so we're gonna stay in whatever tier it is. I don't know what tier we're in. Now, I do know one thing. I still have to talk this out with Vic, but I need to get my final measurements in for this desk rework. Seven hundred and ninety centimeters. If you don't have a tape measure at your desk, why? Why don't you have a tape measure at your desk? <clears throat> Everybody should have a tape measure at their desk. I 
got a bunch of 20 slots. Oh, we have a 32 and we have a 24, but this character I really need to get those things on there. But I'm waiting for something to sell in the trading post, so. We got a plethora of these things. Well, this, this, the frag, the imperial and bloodstone and dragonite. That's that's always there. But other other things. these and we sell these I do know one thing. So while the vampire masquerade is going on, I mean, if it continues to go on, which I'm pretty sure it will, <clears throat> it gives me a, a chance to check out some of the other systems I've been kind of curious about on the Foundry. I can only have one active instance going on the Foundry at a time. So I do have 5th edition D&D &D in there, but that's, that's not the one I'm interested in. There's two game systems. One of them is just pure sh in sheer curiosity, but they have an alien TTRPG. Like Xenomorph Alien. Like Alien, the role playing game. You have two to six players. I'm just sheerly curious about how this one works. So there's that. Um. I'm also wanting to see how how one goes about um, in creating a system for stuff like that. So I'll do some of the, the groundwork for that project I've been wanting to do. While we're doing this, I can change up some of the stream info stuff here.
I just gotta wait. Wait for like six more minutes. Nothing shows up in this anymore? Wait, does... No. Little guild. Oh, this timer is so long. So it says 22 seconds remaining in current skirmish. If I remember correctly, that should be the last one for this, and there's like one more that happens. Oh, man. But yeah, so tomorrow is double guide whammy day. <laughs> I'm pretty confident that the Real Jack Basics, that's going to be like the introductory thing for Warframe. Um, and then that also, the way I have it structured is that it allows me to expand upon it, kind of like the companion guide for later on. Um, and then... <laughs> then Drizzlewood. I I'm honestly thinking that I'll do Drizzlewood as one one thing. Right, right. Left it. Where is it? Oh, it's further north, I think. Oh, I don't have it on this character. That's why. Oh my god. Yeah, it's right there. This is how you get into Rogue's World. Can I get the world versus world?
I mean, that's EBG gate right there. Travel F, enter, clear. I know it's been a while that you haven't been in this game, but, like... I mean, I can make it go all the way dark. I have 19 in queue. going out against FA. It's your D, FA, and then we still have Ipe with us. Alright. Oh sweet, they put a Jadebot terminal here. Flies. Mm. Not what I was thinking. Okay. That's actually pretty cool. Gives you something to do. There must be something here then for it. I'm looking for something that I might be able to interact with in this. I don't see anything though. So what the fuck? They just stuck it in here and just like, yeah, people can do something while they wait. I guess. Kind of weird. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Oh, I can't go in there. Okay, this is a little ridiculous. How high can you go with the J-Pod? Oh, I hit the ceiling. I don't know what the point of that was. Wait, you can actually just access the dungeons this way? Tells you how much i am spent time in LA. Holy crap. That's cool. So you don't even have to like go to that thing anymore. You just pop over to this. Hmm. That's cool. Yeah, I have not. Hmm. I have number 13. Oh, shit, they moved him. Oh, shit, they moved the NPC. Oh, my God. Oh my god, where do you find those guys now? Wait, it was them over here, wasn't it? Yeah! Oh my god, why do they keep- Why do they move them? Oh, that reminds me! Now that I thought I see this and the, the D dungeon historian actually triggered this. Um, next week, not doing Guild Wars 2, we're actually doing Guild Wars 1. I posted it in Discord, so if you want to do some Guild Wars 1 stuff, we're not going to do what we did last time. Um, we're going to do lower level stuff while everybody relearns how to play that game. That was a bit rough, not going to lie. So yeah, sign up. Let me know if you're interested. Actually, yep, right there. Welcome to Gilders One. Put it there. So <clears throat> it's gonna be on the nineteenth stream time. So let me know. Um, since that game is old, I don't expect a lot of people to have a lot of things completed. Like, I don't even have everything completed. I, I, I can access a bunch of stuff, but, like, I don't have my HOM completed. Like, not really at all. And stuff like that. So. Yeah, we can totally do the, um, Guild Wars one night. We totally did not do that last month. I did not realize that until like the month came and went. So I'm like, oh shit. So, um, I mean, I would love to do dungeons in that game, but just we don't really have the numbers to go and do them. So what we can do is maybe we could just do submissions. Hell, if anybody needs a, a playthrough of you know prophecies or something like that, we can just go and do that, or factions, like we can do some story mode for some peeps.
I don't have a relic on my character, but it's because this is my PB. A different PB bar. But anyway. Yeah, we can totally go do that. Also, make sure that you, on Discord, make sure that you are signed up for Guild Wars 1 pings. Since that's not really, you know, like a common thing, that's one that you could probably, like, react, reaction roll for that so that you get the pings for it, so... I don't think a lot of people have that actual research settings. Polls. Yeah, it's literally just Orion and me. So. But yeah, you don't have to worry about getting pings for that because it's literally going to be like once a month. You get the ping, so. I'm gonna go over here and do this. We could try to go do that jumping puzzle, actually, and see how far we get. Like that jumping puzzle. That was a mesmer portal for a second. I'm like, the hell? See, say hi to the cheeky ghost. Jumping is hard. I think it was Darth that uh got into this and then he was like gonna follow the ghost and I'm like don't follow the ghost. Don't follow the ghost. Do not follow that ghost. He's an asshole. <laughs>
Yeah, just, you can definitely go through this faster, but... Fucking ghost is laughing, that's just, yeah, whenever you get down. down I believe yeah. God it's been a while. That's a motherfucker right there. This is the other one that you land in, it was right here. I don't remember. There's like two of them that you can go and land at. You can always go straight. Do I have all of these skins? I do. So that was one jumping puzzle, right? I don't know if trolls is around anymore. Like, it's been too long. It has been way too long.
I know it's there, but I don't remember how to get to the start of it. A dead end, okay. Still miss the old all I know that there's a way to get that. I just it's a really hard thing, apparently, because I tried. You have to get like a coordinated group effort for that thing. I don't remember. I know that they replaced it after they destroyed LA. Trolls and Memory of Old Lion's Arch. So I'd have to get that. Yeah. Alright, so we did Wayant's Revenge. Oh, there's two of them. Trolls Revenge and Ermog's Secret. Build a bluff waypoint. <laughs> Starting behind Ermog. Is this the one I'm thinking it is? I don't think that one is. Oh no, that one might be the one I'm thinking it is. Is it a cavern?
This one is frustrating when I remember now. <laughs> that was it? Yeah, that's not the one I was thinking it was. That can't be it. No, that is. No, that is it. Okay. It's short. It's not the one I was thinking. There's one that's like... <sighs> you're kind of high and you have to stay above the ground because you have to like jump from platform to platform and some of them run along the rocky sides. I don't think that... I was thinking it was that one. But... Fort Mariner. Starts off at the Fort Mariner waypoint. Run along the bridge. Okay, reach the last archway on the right side. The jumping puzzle starts after jumping over the barrels to the wooden planks on the left. Today I learned there's actually three jumping puzzles in this game. In this map, I mean. that one back there. Which is funny because I think I have all the jumping puzzles done from the core game. Yeah, so it's been too long. Okay, this one I kind of remember. Where it goes, though, I don't remember. Across the rooftops on the cliffs. Just use your mount for this. You don't actually have to do the jumping part this for this then, okay. I mean, yeah, it kind of ruins the, the immersion, but, I mean, if you want to be honest. I 
This is what you just need to find the four keys. Says that this one continue going. Second chest is on a boat suspended from the closest tower. Two. Third one from the rooftops. Around the cliffs and then run and hop across a series of ropes up to the top of the cliffs where you'll find the third chest. three. There's a cave here? Shit, there's a cave here. Okay. This last one. Uh, this one's not even in the cave. Oh my god. Abandoned <laughs> ship. The people just having a party and sit down in there. So this last one has like some holes. This looks like it's going over towards the script. Roland's chest. There it is. It is now eight thirty eight. You are almost an hour later. Look at that. Look at that. Now you're good. Welcome back. Making sure you're doing your job, huh?
I don't think I'm going to get into all this world tonight. It's not bad per se, loot wise, but. Uh... Oh, it's not worth it. Nice. Dubby-dubbing happening. It's okay. We're gonna do something. Um, I mean, I could do world map completion on this character. I could do that. While we wait. Or we could just scrap the idea and go do Drizzlewood because Drizzlewood. Yeah, let's do it. I was feeling pretty brave at that point, and now I'm just like, mm. uh, something else, a bit more productive, instead of waiting to get in there. Oh lord, what is your mixings? These are folk back. There's 60 people trying to get into World vs. World's uh, BBG. Fuck that shit. I'll pass. I'm gonna go do a Drizzlewood. Nice. Was that the coffee sugar container? back. Muy importante.
No. So what happened was he had he went to go drop off um, croutons, homemade croutons to his aunt. And when he did that, I decided to make a fresh pot of coffee. And then I made myself some cold coffee. That's what I was sucking down at the beginning of the stream. And then I heard... It's a very distinct sound when you take the lid off of the sugar container. And then I heard the tink, tink, tink of the spoon in the coffee cup. And I was like, he's getting himself coffee. I want to go get a drink refill with Pamika, though, so... Oh, fuck it. We'll just do drizzle wood. We'll just do drizzle wood because I don't know any better. Reminds me. In a second, looking for something. No coffee for you. No, 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 no. Coffee makes everybody happy in this house, okay? Crazy. Oh, we just started this map. Perfect. Take it down. So this map is going to be the video for tomorrow. There's a lot to unpack with this, so I'm not quite sure how how long that video is going to be. <laughs> Oh, you got the message? Just 
Jesus Christ. I would not say such things, but okay. I swear to god, those drugs you're on, kitty, really fuck you up. I swear to god. What that bullet's gonna say, though? I'm fine, I'll go out to this one. I don't even know, man. No, they don't. Jesus Christ. Let me tell you the we have a Chili's. Chili's exists in Mexico. Taco Bell doesn't. I should tell you something.
This exists in Mexico. I'm going to be honest. I didn't think that this would, but Taco Bell does not. So let's go. Come on. Who, me? I'm not okay because Kitty's sitting there going on and talking about bullshit Taco Bell as a reward. I'm like, what the shit? She's driving me crazy. Lord have mercy. We're good. Taco Bell is not a reward. It should never be seen as a reward. We can raise morale. Statue. Uh, 
Boss Legion Machine to again. So essentially, this is all the same thing. It's you push, take over, defend, next one push, take over. Like they're pretty rinse and repeat. Bitch. Going, 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 going. What kind of bread are you making tonight, kitty? Let's wait until we get rid of the that X. No, we did not. Well, we got rid of that one, but we still got one more to go. Yummy breadsticks. Ooh. Something done in here. Stupid weak nigger. Oh, 
Or this one likes to disappear, huh? I think I need to go turn something in. Okay, maybe not. Oh, I did! I gave him two. Okay. Snap craggly bop. Oh, the tanky is so very sure. Okay. Somebody up here is injured and it's bothering me. Special mission. I thought I was done with all this. Oh, I'm not. I still have some. I feel like I have spent like over a year of just doing things in this map alone and I'm still not done.
sorry. Come. I mean, that's essentially what baking is, isn't it? Oh, that's what you mean. Well, that's not going to get done. So that's done. So weird. So the lighthouse, swatting mosquitoes, the forest, and there's more bugs. You're the, why don't I have this done yet? Wow. Oh, that's a lot. That is a lot. I, Jesus. <sighs> okay. You just get commendations though, you don't really get anything. Oh, sweet, we're like, they're at the end of this part. to the big one. Just think after stream, I'm going to be doing more of this. That's good though. That way I remember how to do these things. Yeah. Well, maybe for you guys. I can safely attest that you know, one o'clock, two o'clock in the morning, I still see some people delivering here. I got run over.
I'm sure that when Esteban comes for a visit, he's probably going to be getting stuff like that. He's gonna be more in the central part though, downtown. Nope, they won't let him in. How can you say that's medication? It's not even close to anything. No, 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 no. I mean, you get hella loot from this map, though, so... Oh, baby girl. Going for another cup of coffee? Bruh. <sighs> you alright? to put them in the microwave. <laughs> oh, jeez. Not even coffee. Okay. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, this is the wall. I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah, no. Um, we actually went, we kind of started our weekend early. Um, and we went to a candy store that's nearby and got some gummies. Um, the little shark ones and then like the teeth and gums. It smelled like a dollar. And then, um, we got Vic some things. They're called Winnie's. They're like Starburst. Only they're not that new. They're kind of hard, so he has to stick them in the microwave to stop on them. Why would you want them unwrapped? It's a little weird. I, mean, I don't think I'm going to open up caches. I want to open more like after we do this cycle. But, um, Here, hold on. I haven't even like really planned it tomorrow out all the way. <laughs> we'll get there, we'll get there. But um I have some places that I wanna kind of explore. What do you have? Oh come on dog, we're not doing this again. Hold on. Be right back. No, Katie keeps finding pieces of wood and she's chewing on them and we don't know where she's finding them from. Like legit, I don't know where the fuck she's finding them. She gets fed in 30 minutes. It's She started finding pieces of wood last night. 
Um, I did the after stream party. And all of a sudden, I just hear this big old crunch coming from behind me. I was like, what the shit? And she had like a piece of wood and she was just nomming on it. And then we had to get it out of her mouth. And she was like, no, it's my piece of wood. I found it. And having a dog is like having an eternal like two or three year old. What's in your mouth? Well, that's where Vic's computer is. That's like where he is. And I am went in there. I'm like, where is she finding this? That's not all. I don't know where she's finding them, but. No, it's not that. It's just I don't know where she's finding them. Anyway, no. Um, I'm hoping that tomorrow we can get. And the last stop that I kind of want to go to would be the um, Home Depot. It's kind of cool. So, Fallout's? Yeah, no, Fallout's pretty cool. I'm enjoying it. We only made it through the uh, two episodes before we called it because it was coming up on six o'clock in the morning, but. Oh, Jesus. So, I've never played the Fallout games. I don't know how close to canon that this thing is, but I liked it. Oh yeah, I need to go buy more uh, Ash Keys. I got those things. Hmm. Prismatic clasp. What does this have? Cloaked in the Scales collection is the Dragon Scale Cape. Ew, I do not like that. It's an ascended back piece, though. Cloaked in scales. Yeah, I don't like that cape. That's kind of icky. Ah, <sighs> I 
get this. I have to make it. Prismatium ingots. Jesus Christ. There's always something going on in this game. So I do have some. I have like six of those, but huh. It's a level four hundred. I mean, I have to get the but the the accommodations because that's what makes the world go around in this map. So. Get the savage. I need to air out my ear. It's hot.
the fucking choices. Some salvage. Eh, as I said, I don't know if it's canon, but since I have never played the games, I get to claim ignorance. Although I do feel like, you know, the, from the parts that I have seen other people playing, I do feel like they captured the silliness. It is pretty, pretty gruesome. There's Fallout 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I don't even know if New Vegas is classified as one of those. Fallout, Fallout 2, Fallout 3, Fallout 4, Fallout 5, Fallout Tactics, Brotherhood of Steel, Fallout, Fallout Brotherhood of Steel, Fallout New Vegas, Fallout Shelter, Fallout Pinball, Fallout 76, Fallout Shelter Online. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's 12 games. only thing that got me really interested in that is because I really like the aesthetic that they have, um, the post apoc so.
Now, I do know that I have Fallout 3 for the PS3. And I've got the other ones somewhere. I don't remember which ones I stopped with. Well, according to you, I thought he got rid of all of his game systems because he doesn't like console games due to GameStop. I mean, that's going to be true with a lot of things. But, if he's really, you know, trying to get rid of consoles and stuff because of, you know, reasons, there is a lot of emulators out there. The only reason I know about the emulators is because Esteban apparently plays a lot of the classics on emulators. This one you just need something.
Okay, now that's coffee he's going work for. Now I hear the tinky tinky tink 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 tink. Exactly kidding. Rays are doing stuff. Good morning, I saw. What is she angry? <laughs> Okay, it's okay. Yeah, we're gonna go plant some bombs and play. This is unfortunate, kitty. Right, sitting there ignoring the cell phone's needs.
Well, clearly it wasn't done. Can it though? Can it really wait? Like, do you know for sure? So, this past Sunday, we made three loaves of bread. We sold one. We had two left over. We were kind of planning on keeping one of them for ourselves because we might get some peanut butter and some jelly. You know, simple basic stuff. And you know, replenish the croutons because we were out of croutons. Needless to say, one and a half loaves of bread makes a shit ton of croutons. And they taste amazing. I have to replenish the uh, onion powder that I made. Um, luckily, we saw some onions on sale. So, we bought some of that. This time, we're adding in a yellow onion to the mix. Usually, it's just been a white onion and green onions. Yellow onion was on sale. Also, I'm going to be honest, if you do have means of dehydrating vegetables, try dehydrating onions. Get yourself some nice variety of onions. Chop them up, stick them on a dehydrator or whatever you do to dehydrate things, dry them out. And you can do them in the oven or a toaster oven if you really want to. I honestly like it better because I feel like you can make a little bit more of a flavored variety of green onion or not green, onion powder. So.
Oh, I almost missed that. And as we have learned, you don't want to touch that down there. some dark steel in here. Who is named Lick? I might as well I gotta start up the Pal World server again. Um, we did some changes, not to the server itself, but we did some changes to the the computer that it's been hosted on. So. It shouldn't affect it though. If anything, it'll make it better. But... Gotta put that back up. Can do it tomorrow. Especially now that there's like new stuff in there. We did do the update, so make sure that your client is updated. This is the new one, right? Yeah.
the hammer. I could go faster. Jadebot's going crazy and finding a bunch of stuff, though. It's good. Person down, person up. Seconds. That one is this one. Just remember I had to change something. That's rude. Alright.
Tja. Uh oh, Grumpy Catmander is down. Okay, Grumpy Catmander back up. First time I've actually seen people clear this before, before approaching that. I'm impressed. Here, the pony bow. God, I wish Necromancer had a bow. Eventually, at some point in time, they will. I mean, the rate that we're going for everything else. Like six people doing this meta? Oh, okay, that's that's what's up. Goes one. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm gonna be here all day.
Vroom, vroom. I'm on fire, I'm on fire, I'm on fire. I mean, you basically just get in here and you just spam all of the buttons. I can save the last 200, yep. Cruising right along. No! I totally thought that was something else, and I'm like, oh yeah, I can go get rid of this. I'm not going to be able to get back to that one either. God damn it. It was a thing to fractals of the mist. I thought it was a chest. Oh. I did that. I'm gonna be stuck on a map that's like not even close to the map. Damn it. <laughs> ah! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, God. Oh, okay. It's okay. Damn it. <laughs> Son of Why did I do that? Why did I do that? <sighs> I mean, I know why, because I was like, oh, chest. Why I thought it was a chest? I don't know. Brain, brain was like, mm, get rid of. <sighs> mm. 
This is not there anymore. Oh, well. Don't know what you want for breakfast? What are your options? Leftovers or miso? I mean, that's also a mood. It's definitely a mood. Coffee. Just go go with coffee. You can't go wrong with coffee. You can use coffee as a food substitute. <laughs> I'm kidding. Don't. Don't do that. That is bad advice. Ooh. 
I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Coffee just, you know, get your brain going. That happy, fuzzy feeling. I've had days like that too. <laughs> what is breathing? What is life thinking? What is that? to do that all over again. I don't want to do it. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. We'll do it. We'll do it. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. You might lose your, you know, sanity, but... Threaten the Orion has started watching Fallout. Yeah, we only got through the first two episodes uh, last night slash this morning. Oh my god, I have over that many silver ingots. Okay. Oh yeah, we only got through the first two episodes though. Because by the time that the second one was done, it was like 6 o'clock in the morning. You know, just sleep. Inside and have a nice cup of tea. Hey, hey, thanks for the follow. Murder, 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 murder. Okay, no, I gotta hold on to these because I'm trying to get my like small little collection going on. <sighs> what do I have? 105? Oof. Yeah, we'll wait on that. We'll wait on that. Oh, yeah. 
you're not going after that effigy thing. That one pops up a lot. <sighs> so since we're not, so we're not going to need to do that. I'm trying to hold on to the, my caches. I keep forgetting, like, I know that I'm like, oh yeah, I want to do this today. Clearly that's just a lie to myself. <laughs> I need to, I need to write down my to-do things, and I just haven't. But I definitely need to come into here every day and grab those five um, cash keys for, was it 25 for supply? Something like that. I still can't believe I'm not done with the things in here. I, like, I swear to God, like, they made this so that you don't get done with it quick at all. But at least I'm on the special mission parts. And apparently this is a repeatable thing. Really? Yeah, they get so give you stuff while you're in here, so that's that's something. Most of the lighthouse. I think that stuff is already done. I don't think I can do that anymore. Let's fight up. No. I was thinking that would be it, but that is it's not anywhere near what I was thinking. Okay. Oh, hey. Should have... Hold on. Feed the troops. Spend 600 board supplies to repair damaged structures or purchase base upgrades. This is the lighthouse, right? This may not be the lighthouse. Although I'm pretty sure that- oh no, this is the lighthouse. God damn it! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Jesus! Ah! What is wrong with me? Okay. It's like, that's an awfully short lighthouse, too. There we go. Yes. Oh my god. Alright. Bring six, no, bring food to six exhausted sentries. That's an injured sentry. Yo, where the hungry ones at? Hmm. 
Okay, we're gonna grab this. Alright, I guess if we get hungry on the way we can eat it, I don't know. There is somebody who's hungry. Welcome back, kitty. None of you guys hungry? This looks like the leg on a dull yak. Nobody wants this. Come on, dull yak leg. Let's go. You shaped the dough. Okay. I don't know. Maybe they know something I don't. Maybe the cook is really bad. These dudes are hungry. Are you fucking kidding me? Bruh. Wait, I know where one of them. There's one that's usually hungry that's over here. If you tell me that you're going to stick the slatter buns on the side of the pizza for like a weird ass pizza crust, I'm gonna be like, I'm so gonna tune you out. Yep, still got the leg, okay. There you go, all the way from the north. And six more of those. A pair of five listing devices. Wait. We do.
When do you get the actual mastery points? Never. I don't think you get the mastery points at the conclusion of this. You know, you might. I don't know. So I need to do two more. Ugh. Two more scraps of paper. Jump all the string color weapons? See this? What? Mm. So legit, storm color weapons. And then pieces of paper. Apparently I just need to find two more pieces of paper. They got it. I got my hits in. I'm gonna go collect some of this wreckage. Ow. It's like I just did this like 30 minutes ago. I'm still kind of upset about the fact that I decided to just take that and like dismiss myself from all of that. Can't believe I did that. So the more I'm thinking about it, right, I'm, I'm just reviewing things in my head right now, but um, I don't think I'll be able to get the video done tomorrow for this. I can definitely have it started, but with how long this meta takes, I mean, unless I get completely lucky and I find, you know, two, like, two different map instances that are at different levels. I might have to get that video done for Sunday.
I don't know. We'll find out. I already grabbed a couple of um, things for the preview video, so got those. Well, some of those. I want the savage! Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh my god, I cannot extract this. There we go. Christ! Bang there, can I go suck it? That's new. So, but yeah, I think that's what we're going to have to end up doing. Um, we've been working on it tonight, but you know, within reason. I honestly, I don't think I'm going to have it done for tomorrow. I'll try. Not going to make any promises, though. Now I'm looking for like pieces of paper. I can't even defuse them because other people do. Okay. Super quick. I'm like waiting. I'm like, all right, let's go. And then it's like, nah, somebody else got it.
I will admit though, this is a great map for farming things. I always find myself in here. Because <clears throat> farming! Legendaries do not make themselves. Sometimes I wish they did, but... Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm talking about Gen 1. I'm still working on my Gen 1s here, so... This is the point when I tell you that I actually have another dreamer on the market. I'm waiting for it to sell so that I can take the money and dump it into my own things. And I made that with the stuff from the starter kit legendaries. <sighs> Bro, I'm selling it for 2k. <laughs> I'm patient. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sure you do. But yeah, no, I totally from because I actually got a uh, the gift of might, gift of magic from two of the things, two of the seasons. Took that extra dreamer one that I was gonna do for a a, a giveaway, which sad to say I haven't done that yet. Oops. Maybe this year I'll do it. But yeah, it's on the market. It's on the trading post. Nah, nah. I want to sell it for 2k. I'm sorry, ISO. Um, 2,000 gold, kitty, in this game. Yes. Much like everything else in the trading post, when you list something, they're just like, yeah, you know, I can do that. Naturally, like, 12 people decide to post their shit for less. I'm patient. You'd be surprised. People have that in this game. It's so many things. Jesus. Oh my god, that's gonna take some time. Hold on. You need to play the game, first of all, kitty. Transactions, the dreamer. Somebody bought the cheaper one. But yeah, no, I am waiting. This is mine right here. But yeah, no, it'll eventually it'll get there. This the trading market in this game fluctuates a lot. So. Um, the thing that usually ends up happening is that people have the, the gold, right? They want the thing, but, um, I mean, I'm not saying this is everybody. There's a lot of people who do gold farming 
Um, they don't want to do map completion because I'm going to be honest, map completion is for psychopaths. And you need to do that in order to get a legendary gen 1. So. Bro, I think everybody needs a sugar mama or a sugar dada in, in real life. Are you kidding me? No strings attached. But anyway. I'm not gonna totally do Siege Turtle in this. Kitty, your addiction is Amazon and eBay. Just be glad you haven't discovered Themu yet. That's, that's, that's not good. That's not good, Kitty. I'm gonna stick here and try to get some of this wreckage. Why do you have 300 items on your eBay wish list? What the fuck? Apparently. I thought you were about at Pinterest, but Jesus. I mean, bro, don't you bro me? Kitty, everything apparently is of what you're trying. Oh my god. How many addictions do you have? Because, you know, crack is apparently an addiction too, so. Kitty, you need therapy. In case if you guys don't know, whoever's watching, you're wondering what the hell's going on. Kitty's my sister, like IRL sister. So. Just shit talking my sister. Oops.
Last thing I need is the people to think they're like, ah, she's being so mean to this one person. Nah, man. Alright. But I'm gonna be honest, if you knew the weird shit that she sent me at the weirdest times of day, it's a trade off. I totally forgot that I allowed you to have Amazon power. Oh my god. Oh my god. I haven't looked at this in like six months. Oh my god, what is it gonna look like? What the fuck? Oh my god. A tortilla blanket. Hey man, I can go for that big ass container of Tic Tacs though. What is this? Oh. Tortilla blanket? What? Don't you broth me. Why do I want to wrap up as a burrito? It's a weird RP session that you're coming up with. Okay. Yep, my mind just went in a dark place or a naughty place. Jesus Christ. Nope, 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 it can't, it can't, it can't get out of my head now. Dishonor, shame. Psst. That dog does not tell you a damn thing. doesn't know how to text. What the fuck are boba pearls? The ultimate boba kit. Wait. Too bad that doesn't ship apparently. Yeah, I know. Oh, hey, the matcha tea. Oh, man. Oh, it doesn't ship, though. God damn. This is oh okay. It's rainbow boba tea, real tapioca pearls, ready in five minutes. And of course, there's a yenna coin on it. Of course, you are. As a nuts. Why is that pink? Why the shit is that pink?
You know, they have other colors. They've got black, they've got blue, green, red, gray. And what does she have to put? It's called Dusty Rose. Are you fucking kidding? Oh my fucking god. Oh, I can get behind this one. The Takio. The Taco. The Takoyaki Maker. Mmm. So good. I'm going to have to go and clean this up a little bit. <laughs> oh my god. All right, boys and girls, and everything that's in between. That is it for me this evening. We've got, we've got stuff going on. Right, right down there. Um, what do you mean? No, I'm sorry. I so I'm sorry, but it's it's after 11 p.m. for me, so I still have to do a guide for this, the video port. So, but yeah, um, I'm going to leave you guys with that. Um, tomorrow, for those of you that are in the in the Discord and are a part of the Vampire the Masquerade campaign that's going on, make sure that you show up. Hellraiser is taking over because I just, I can't get myself to do it. So, he's taking over. Um, from what I understand, it's, you don't need to have access to the Foundry for this, so... And remember this, I mean, unless he's changed it, but remember that this is still, you know, just testing to see if you guys wanted to do it. So. There's that. Um, I am going to be AFK tomorrow from stuff, because I am going to be going and spending the day with Nick. Outs and abouts, because we haven't done that. We haven't done that in a really long time. So that's our plan for tomorrow. Um, but I will be around later tomorrow night, obviously, because, you know, that's just, you know, normal times, so. Yeah. So, but yeah, that's all I have got. Um, we'll be back on Tuesday for more streaming. We're going to start it, obviously, off with Arma 3, and then, you know, just look at the schedule down below. But I will catch you guys on Tuesday. Nah, Kita's gonna stay home. We can't take her into some of those places. Imagine trying to take her into Home Depot, and Home Depot's gonna be like, what the fuck are you doing? That dog gets anxious. Alright? No, that dog gets super anxious. Can't even take her to the meat shop anymore without her, like, fucking freaking out, so... Which is really weird because I took her there when Vic was working there. She had no issues, but now it's like he's not there and she's just like super fucking scared or I don't know. Also, the other night we took her to go potty. It was like three o'clock in the morning and this loud truck went by. Um, I think it was the watering truck, the one that just passes through the streets and waters the plants that are along the side because, you know, government stuff. Um, she freaked out and she hit her head on his face really hard so can't take that dog in places like she just she's she's getting kind of weird she's getting kind of squirrely so no we're not taking her at all <laughs> anyway tuesday for streaming um check out tomorrow for the real jack basics guide that's going to be published on my website and hopefully I can get the Drizzlewood Coast meta video done. I mean, that's already written. It's just I have to get the footage for it and then do recording and everything else. So until then, I will see you guys. Take care. Stay safe. Bye-bye. Well, That's it, man. Game over, man.